Okay, you guys, I'm going to show you how to measure with a liquid. So we've already talked about um, measuring dry ingredients. The rule of thumb is this. If you can drink it, it's going to go into a liquid measuring cup. There's a few reasons that a liquid measuring cup is better than a dry measuring cup when it comes to a liquid. The first reason is look at it. It's designed to pour things, so that should tell you use a liquid. Second thing is if you look, the two cup mark is all the way here, but there's all this space here. So if I pour a liquid in it, it's not going to spill over top. The other really great thing about it is that it's made out of Pyrex, which is a really thick type of glass, so you can put a liquid in it. And hello, it's a clear container. So that's the first thing. This is why we use this whenever measuring something that you can actually drink. So I want to show you the rules for measuring with a liquid. The first is do not hold it in the air. You put it onto a hard surface. You'll see there's several different measurements. There's your cup measurements. There's your ounce measurements. So if you ever see a recipe that asks for ounces, you can find it on here, as well as on this side, milliliters. So both options are available on the same cup, so that's super handy. So the first thing we do is we put it onto a flat surface. You get out your liquid, and then you bend down to eye level, and you pour at eye level. And I'm going to pour her half a cup. Now, oops, I went over. So if you go over, don't worry. Pour it back into the container. And then, oh, that was actually pretty good. Pour it back into the container. And if you need more, add again. So that gives me my half cup measure. Now, I'm going to show you when things get a little bit finicky. So I'm going to put this back in here first. There's some ingredients that are really hard to decide. Should I use a liquid measuring cup? Should I use a dry measuring cup? Now, this is plain yogurt. It's pretty thick, but it's also got a slightly liquidy texture. I could put it in the liquid measuring cup, but it's gonna be really hard to get it level. Another thing is, for example, applesauce. If I put it in here, I'm gonna show you this. This is homemade applesauce, you guys. If I put it in here, and I'm having to try to level it down and make it flat, it's really, really difficult. Whereas if I put it into the dry measuring cup, I could scoop it in. And then when I'm done, I could level it. And that's gonna make it much easier to measure. So think of it that way. If you think it's an item that would be better to level versus trying to play around with this, use your dry measuring cup. So one last time, Liquid measuring cup for anything you can drink. And remember, not that you want to drink, that you could drink. And that's it.